Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to add a signature in email here in Zoho. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time in Zoho, I need you to click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Adding a signature in Zoho Mail is a straightforward process that could give your email a professional look because it provides important contact details and ensures your communication appears polished and legitimate, especially in business settings. Once you are logged into your Zoho account, I want you to click on the Mail option here. Now, once you have access to the Zoho Mail, I want you to click on the gear icon in the upper right corner. Click on that and there's going to be an option here that says signature on the left side pane. Okay, so you can also want to check on the uh, theme if you're ready here. Click on signature. Now, you don't want to bombard so much information for your um, Zoho signature because your signature allows you to include essential contact details such as your name, phone number, and address, making it easy for recipients to reach out without needing to ask for further information. In my case, I'm going to add my signature here. Okay, so I'm going to add information here. This is our YouTube channel. If you haven't already, you might want to click on the uh, sign up button or subscribe button. I'm going to make it red so you have uh, the more control over your um, signature. You can change uh, the color that you wanted. For example, I'm going to be choosing a blue. I'm going to add some picture. Now, once you are happy with that, all you have to do is you can place this signature above coded content or you can place this signature below coded content. It's all up to you. You can also put in the email address from associated address for your replies. All right. So you have all these control. You can uh, put in the associate contact card if you want it. Right. But of course, if you don't have any contacts yet, you're not going to be able to do the, uh, to do so. All right. Once you are happy with that, all I'm going to do is click on update. Just wait for it. Once it's saved. All right. Let's say I'm going to create a new mail. All right. Let's see if that's you see that we have already have this signature here on the email. I'm going to add some more files. For example, I'm going to add an image. I'm going to choose an image from uh, my computer, my desk. That's going to be on top. And another logo. So you have the option for the small original fit to width. I'm going to insert that. Now, once you have included your company logo, website, and tagline, ref, it, it reinforces your brand identity with every email. This helps you maintain consistent branding across all your communications. All right. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.